everyone, welcome. My name is Sophie. I'm a nursing student and I'm officially halfway done with my 15 month long accelerated BSN program. And I also just finished my OB clinical rotation. So before going through my bag and preparing it for my pediatrics and med surge rotation for next semester, I thought I would do a what's in my clinical bag and go through it with you all. So I do have the BagSmart tote. It's very spacious. I have a hand sanitizer here and I have my 32 ounce hydro flask here. You can also hold a coffee or tea cup here, which is what I did. And then I have my badge on the outside. The only thing I don't like about this bag is it does hurt my shoulder when carrying it around. Um, so I would keep that in mind before purchasing it if you are thinking about buying it. Um, but here's my badge reel. And then I have my hospital badge on one side and my school badge on the other side. And then with the hospital badge came this like safety card. So it has phone numbers for like a needle stick line and it has like a security services phone number. And then it also has what all the different codes mean right here, which was really useful because we got, I heard a lot of codes over the speaker. Okay. And then this is my lunch bag. Um, I just got off Amazon and I'll link everything if I can down below. It's insulated and it, I could actually fit this in my bag smart in my tote, which was really nice. And the only thing I have in here is some tea in case I'm feeling some tea throughout the day. Okay, first thing first, I have my stethoscope case and I have my Lippmann stethoscope. I love it so much. I love the color. And that's all I keep in there. And then I have a trifold clipboard. The bifold one, like the width of it, was too wide for my scrub pocket. So I got the trifold and it's awesome. Um, and then it has some really great information on the back here as well. And it folds up like super slim too. Next I have a pencil pouch. And here I just have a bunch of pens and highlighters. And then I believe I also have a pen light in here, which I have yet to use. Hopefully I'll use it in med surge or peds. Next, I have an extra long sleeve under scrub top, just in case it ever got cold. Um, I haven't used it, but I'll probably wash it and bring it for my med surge and peds rotations, just in case. Then I have a medication chart assignment. This has about 50 medications on it. Um, and it was an assignment that our professor had us clinical students collaborate on before the semester began. And it just has a bunch of medications that are commonly found in obstetrics. So like nephedipine, pitocin, misoprostol, methargen, hemabate, etc. You get the gist. Um, but if I was ever working with like, let's say a patient who was on mag sulfate and I hadn't worked with the medication before on my lunch just to self-educate myself I would find it and go through it and look at maybe like the nursing considerations we have written down just to refresh and um, make sure I'm providing the best care that I can to our patients this is a notebook at the end of every clinical day my professor would lecture for about an hour so I would take notes with that here are some data collection sheets. So here's a newborn data collection sheet just to document all the information that we would need for our care plans. And then I believe, yeah, I have one for postpartum and a labor one as well. And then my hospital also provided its patients with a hand postpartum handbook. So I asked my nurse if I could have a copy just so I can familiarize myself with the kind of patient education that I would be providing and I found it really useful. So Take advantage of those resources if you have them. Next, I have a bar. You never know when you're going to be extra hungry or need that boost of energy. So I always recommend keeping a non-perishable snack in there. I have an extra claw clip and hair tie, some tissues, my AirPods, hand lotion. Your hands get so dry from all the hand hygiene. I have some acetaminophen and various ad allergy tablets. I have some Carmex and some lanolin cream. A nurse actually gave this to me. It's nipple care cream, but it's amazing for your, your lips. I also have a deodorant. 
some goggles so if i'm working with bodily fluids and i don't want anything getting in my eyes very useful blue light glasses i have a watch i never use this because i just use my apple watch but i guess it's good to have in case my apple watch stops working um kn95 masks a pocket notebook i use this so much i highly recommend for every clinical rotation these are little report cards that the nurses would write all the like most important information down for their patients um, so when they give handoff to the next nurse, they have that information readily available and I would do the same as my nurse did just to get the practice. Some alcohol prep pads. Um, I always had extra of these in my scrub top and bottom pockets, so I just hold on to them. They're super useful. And then I have some tape. So I think that's it. Yeah, I don't have too much. But um, I do need to get a couple things for my peds and med surge rotations. Um, but if any of you recommend anything that I should be keeping in my clinical bag, please let me know in the comments below. And yeah, I hope you all have an amazing day and I will see you next time. Bye.